Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jada and today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me. Today I'm going to be going out with my friend Shell to just grab some drinks, do a cute little quick girls night. So I'm just going to be showing y'all how I get ready for a little girls night. Something cute, something simple. Now I know I got this really loud pink hair right now. I know it looks crazy right now, but wait till the end where I get everything together, my makeup, and I curl my hair up and it's gonna look real cute because I know it look crazy right now. Just give me a second. So I already showered and everything. I already showered and brushed my teeth and did everything like that. So really all I stuff to do is do my makeup, curl my hair, and put on my outfit and then I'm gonna be ready to go. Honestly, I was supposed to be there at 9.30 and it's 9.30 right now. So I really need to hurry up and stop jibber jabbering and get to it. So during my get ready with me, I'm gonna do like a quick little mini story time. It's honestly nothing too interesting, but it's just like something that happened today that I just thought I would talk about during my get ready with me. <laughs> Cause I ain't had nothing to talk about. So let's get started. So it's gonna be super hard to do my makeup and talk at the same time, but I'm gonna still try. And I'm not, I don't have a mirror in front of me. I'm just looking dead at my phone. And I never did that before. So hopefully everything turns out good. I don't know. We finna see. Okay, y'all. I'm gonna do this super quick because I'm running my late. But I'm gonna tell y'all this quick story. That's really nothing serious. It's just what happened today. So I was like, I might as well talk about it because it happened today. So who I'm gonna be talking about is Brooklyn Frost, like the Shay Frost sister. I don't know. I'm sure y'all know who that is. She's She's super cute, super cool. I've been following her forever and I've been following her on YouTube and Instagram. So she always does these like promos, right? Cause like I said, I love her. I've been following her for a long time. So she always does these little promos on her page, right? And I just skip past them because I mean, what do I need to promote? I don't need anything to promote. So usually I just skip past them. She does them pretty often, but you know, it doesn't have anything pertaining to me. So I just skip past them, right? So today I was at work y'all and I scrolled through her Instagram story and I see, oh, she's doing promotions today, right? So when she posted it, it was like 12 hours ago when I like finally seen it, it was the whole 12 hours ago. But I still slid up cause I'm like, you know what? I usually like don't really believe in promotions and I usually never, you know, do any inqu inquiry about a promotion. But since I just started my YouTube, I'm like, okay, you know, maybe, just maybe, maybe just maybe a promotion will be cool for my YouTube, right? Okay. So mind you, I'm at work this whole time. I'm on my lunch break when I see her post. So I slide up on her story with this little, you know, raise a hand emoji like me, you know? So I slide up on her story and I'm like, okay, She's probably not gonna see it for a while because I live in Atlanta and she lives in California. So I'm like, I don't know the time difference because I've never been to California, but I know it's like kind of a big time difference. And it was like early, not early, but it was afternoon for Atlanta. So I know it was early for Cali. So I'm like, okay, she's probably not even gonna see this until way later. So I put my phone away and went back to work and went on about my business. So then an hour later, y'all, I have my notifications off for Instagram. So an hour later, I see, like I get on Instagram and I see that I have a notification, right? And I'm like, okay, maybe, maybe she responded, right? So I go to my DMs and lo and behold, she responded. And y'all, the only thing she said, <laughs> the only thing she said was 200. Y'all, I read that message like, what? $200 for a, per, for a story promotion? $200? <laughs> what? Yeah, I had to read it again and again because I'm looking like $200. Like, yeah, no. Honestly, I'm going to be so for real. 
I know people like Ari and Jada, they, they charge like thousands of dollars for promotion and stuff like that. And I respect everybody's hustle. I'm not saying I don't respect, you know, her hustle. Of course I respect it. But should I be paying $200 for no promotion? The hell? What I look like, shit. I ain't paying $200. Mind you, I'm at I'm I'm my little nine to five job. <laughs> I'm at my nine to five job checking my, checking my Instagram like 200. Where, where I'm at? What? Like, I don't even have like 200 subscribers on fucking, oop. I don't even have 200 subscribers on YouTube. So what I look like sending her $200 to maybe promote my stuff. And then y'all on top of that, like I said, I seen her promotion like 12 hours after she posted it. Like her um her post that she was doing promotions 12 hours after she posted it. And it was no other story after that. Like, you know when celebrities say, okay, I'm doing promotions, the next slide be the promotions. Well, on the next slide it wasn't nothing. So I'm like is she even doing promotions for real or is or is she taking these people money? Not saying she's a scammer. Not saying she's a scammer, but I'm like, I don't even see you promoting anybody after this story post. Like, it's just nothing. It's just blank. So, with me, so with me, I don't like to have notifications. Like, you know how people have 500 um, mess notifications, 15 DM notifications, a hundred TikTok notifications, all type of stuff like that. I hate stuff like that. I clear out all my notifications. So she she told me two hundred dollars, and I wasn't going for it. Like I wasn't paying no two hundred dollars. I just went to her DM and liked it because I, I didn't want her DM like her little uh, notification on my page. So I just liked it. And I, I went on about my business, went back to work, y'all. So then I get another DM, y'all. It say Apple Pay question mark. I'm looking like, what? Girl. <laughs> I guess like giving the giving her message a like was the wrong thing to do. I should have sent a thumbs down. <clears throat> I should have sent a thumbs down or something because I guess giving them the like gave the wrong idea. Like I was interested some more after I seen that $200. So she said, I would pay question mark. I'm like, girl no i was i was like i texted her i said i was interested in seeing her price my my um my little youtube ain't worth it ain't, ain't worth the 200 dollars. and then after that she ain't say nothing else after that and i just thought it was crazy like would y'all pay to would y'all pay 200 dollars for a promotion like am i crazy or 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 what I feel like if you are an entrepreneur or you got like a small business or something, then by all means, not even a small business, but if you are an entrepreneur, I don't know. Actually, I feel like teach his own. If you feel like you wanna give up $200 to somebody, and then on top of that, with promotions, not saying, again, not saying she's a scammer, because I don't know, but with promotions, I always see people like coming to um, social media like, this person scammed me. This person scammed me. I sent them this amount of money for promotion and they never promoted me. They just took my money. And I always been so scared of that. I'm like, I always said to myself, like, how do y'all get scammed by people like that? Like, why do y'all just send money to people that y'all don't know? Meanwhile, me finna send money to somebody I don't know. So I seen $200. Like, but $200 is crazy. Like, maybe a hundred. That's still kind of crazy though, but maybe a hundred, not even a hundred. That girl said two bills. Stop playing with her. She needed two bills. But yeah, that shit is mad. Damn, I put too. I put too much on my nose. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Like, maybe y'all looking at me like, girl, you crazy. I would have paid 200 If y'all want to pay 200 for that, though, y'all go do it. Y'all be my guest. But I'm not. I'm genuinely, like, I'm genuine, genuinely curious. Like, has anybody done a promo and it actually worked? Because that's nothing about promotion. It's not guaranteed to work. So, 
if you send somebody your money, first off, you don't even know for sure if they even gonna like go by their word and, and do that promotion. But how do you know that it's actually gonna do anything for your channel? Like you're just gambling. But I do understand like scare money makes no money, but it, that's too big of a gamble. Like I don't know I don't know anything. But yeah, I just really thought that was I just really thought that was crazy. Yeah, I just went right back to work. I just went right back to working at my little nine to five and kept it pushing. And really Really, this is how I imagine her. This is how I imagine her checking my message. I imagine her waking up in the morning, rolling over, seeing that she got a little a message, a promo inquiry. Inqu Am I saying inquiry? Seeing that she got a little promo inquiry. She yawn, type 200, and roll back over, like on some casual shit. Like, y'all imagine, imagine making money Imagine making two hundred dollars for not even have, having to do anything but but repost somebody posts. Like that's so crazy to me. How much people are making just for doing stuff like that? Like that's absolutely insane. But I salute everybody who does that for real. Cause that's some good easy money for real. Some good old easy cash. But I still, um, I love her though. I just, I, I love her. I just don't, don't love them promo prices. Okay, y'all, I'm done with my makeup. It took about 10 minutes, it took my whole little story time. So now I'm just gonna do my hair and we're done. Okay y'all, so I was gonna um, curl my hair, but since I don't have any time, I'm just gonna flat iron it. I don't have time. I'm super late per usual. I feel like I'm always seeing how late I am, but I'm super late and I gotta go. So I'm just gonna straight iron it and be on my way. Yeah, we made it. And now I gotta help get this girl's shoes on because she got her boobies done.